Our first award is going to be presented by Robert White from the Association of Universities and Colleges in Canada, the Rising Star in International Education Award. Uh, Robert is a senior policy analyst at, at, in international relations at AUCC. Robert, come on up and begin the proceedings. Thank you. Thanks, Randy. This is a great initiative you got, celebrating the successes of everyone here. So right about the award, uh, this, is, this award recognizes tomorrow's leaders, our up and coming talent, and the next generation of leaders and practitioners in the field of international education. This year's winner has risen to the challenge and taken advantage of increased opportunities for new practitioners in the field of international education. She has benefited from the expertise of a strong community of mentors and a tradition of knowledge sharing and collaboration in British Columbia's international education community. However, she has also begun to leave her own mark, developing initiatives and enhancing programs at her home institution. In the words of her nominator, I can't do the voice. I, I could do it, I could do it in the voice. <laughs> In the words of her nominator, she has risen to every challenge and has a depth and understanding of the field far beyond her years. I see in her the qualities of a leader, an enabler, and an advocate. In her two and a half years as international mobility coordinator, she has contributed directly to the tremendous growth of both incoming and outgoing exchange opportunities at her home institution. Kwantlen Polytechnic University. She played a pivotal role in establishing application and data management processes where none existed and coordinated a new student engagement program focused on mentoring and integrating international students into Kwantlen student life. She currently supports a range of programs including field schools, study abroad and international co-op placements and is responsible for all exchange and visiting students at Kwantlen. She has supported her director in dramatically increasing exchange opportunities, but even more importantly, engaging the Kwantlen student community and, and increase the number of Kwantlen students who are looking for an international experience. As well as assisting in the launch of a field school program in Japan, she has created a website for exchange and mobility students and presently serves on NAFSA's Local Arrangements Committee. So please join me in saluting this year's 2011 BCCIE Rising Star in International Education Award winner, cue the fireworks, Andrea Reynolds of Kwantlen Polytechnic University. Um, I just wanted to say thank you, everybody. Um, special thanks to my parents who are here tonight. Um, I think they're the reason why I'm here in this profession, um, by giving me a love for language and culture, by putting me in uh, French immersion. Um, also, thank you to my boyfriend who's here who supports me when it gets a little bit crazy and he always keeps me laughing. And finally, to uh, my boss, Sandra, who nominated me for this award. Um, I felt so fortunate to be able to get a position in such a wonderful industry, but even more fortunate to have such a wonderful mentor who always gives me such opportunities and really puts herself out there to make me grow and improve and, and um, become the best person that I can in this, in this field. And um, thank you to BCCIE also for being such a great forum for networking and for professional development. Um, I'm really proud to be part of such a wonderful community here of professionals and I can only aspire to be as wonderful as many of you are here in this field. Thank you very much.